trip to Mod Boy. Good morning. Time Lovely check, 6.20 in the, the morning. To me. Sounds like we are in Victoria video video already. Like that whole now we'll be stopping at Mansfield I next. <laughs> Drive ka lang. The hills are in Mansfield. Signature on that one there, please, mate. Alright, first thing you want to do is just get the chain undone. Yeah, make sure there's no knots in any of these links. They're not you know, crossed over like that. Because if they're crossed over, they'll break as soon as you drive over them. Everything hangs straight like that, so that all looks good. You've got two size hooks, little hook and your big hook. The little hook goes on first. Towards the inside of the tire, like this. Throw them right over. Get the chain somewhat centered, but don't stress out too much. Okay. What I will get you to do now though is jump in the car, reverse straight back for me mm -hmm. until this gap in the chain is up near this top corner somewhere. But I'll tell you, it's gonna be way colder than this. Really? It's it. It's like, <laughs> I, it was minus three when I looked last time. It's probably six or seven degrees here. Little hook that's on the inside. You need to just hook them onto the very last link of this chain, just like that. So it's nothing fancy, but this is where most people struggle because you've got to reach in behind the wheel and, oh, and okay. it's a bit hard to see. And you just sort of... Now once you've got that one clipped on, you want to point this big hook to the center of the tire. You pull this chain up nice and tight mm -hmm. to work out what link it's going to reach to. Put it through. Now with these spare links, it's important that every second one goes over. Right. If you leave it like this, it's going to scratch all your gear oh, and yeah. your ribs. Right? Mm -hmm. so every second one goes over. Let's pull it back. Uh, okay. Right, now once you get them on though, it's really important you drive forwards 10, 15 metres, jump out and check them. They'll move around a bit, they'll centre themselves in the wheel, they'll either get a little bit looser or a little bit tighter. So just jump out after the first 10, 15 metres, check them and you're good to go. And we got them on nice and slow, 30 k's an hour, and should see how you're driving on a dirt road. Like, and just drive forwards off them all. Yep. That's uh, we gotta get the uh, petrol as well. I think I'll go for the lunch thing. Lunch. Okay. Okay. When you get up there, someone will show you where to park. Mm -hmm. They'll send the taxi to you. Just show that to the taxi driver. That's your. Yep, so another 15k. So you're nearly there. Beautiful. Thank you. See ya. Another 15k. Are you enjoying driving right now? Yes, I am. The road is not in the The thing is, Adelaide Hills. But you must look at look at that. If you drop. Good day in paradise. <laughs> this. Yes. We're going to take you out in your car park spot. We'll get you a taxi straight up to your accommodation. Oh. Hey, how good are we? Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. 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 Here we go guys, finally, we just arrived on our hotel. Say hi. Snowing. A lot of snow. Water. Oh, yeah. We're going on there. Poor Phil there. Ready, Mom? 
Let's see what happens. Lord Side Express and then <laughs> and to sa basa ka na how about si Ankoy it's a cold already Snowman fail. <laughs> Snowball. <laughs> 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 Mapuler village. There's a church up there. Come drink. 